In today's video, we're going to show you how to contain the escape artist, which I think is one of the most difficult things to do in this game. And this defense we're going to show you today is actually fairly simple. You might already be even running some of this stuff, but we're going to show you how you can kind of take it to the next level and be able to take away some of the short reads as well as still be able to kind of contain these mobile quarterbacks. I think this is one of the most difficult things to do in this year's game. But if you have good user and uh, you follow these instructions, you're going to be just fine. So make sure you subscribe if you're new. Also, if you want to get all of my ebooks, join the Patreon. Uh, the defense we're going to be talking about today is the 335 wide out of the 46 playbook. That ebook is in the Patreon, just like all uh, 14 of my offensive and defensive guides are. So if you want to get access to that, again, there's a link in the description. You can hit that link and it'll take you right over where you can join the Patreon for just $10 a month. Super cheap and super good deal you can cancel at any time so if you want to check that out again there's a link in the description guys forgive my voice a little bit i'm a little bit under the weather uh, so just be bear with me as we kind of fight through some of this stuff i don't know if it's COVID or what but uh, just not feeling too good so anyways let's just jump in and uh, what we're going to talk about today is containing escape artists specifically bunch tight end escape artists so what we want to do here is we want to make sure that we have the you know Mike Blitz three Tampa two, you know kind of the standard three three five wide audibles if you will, and then out of the three three five normal, uh, we're gonna come out in safety nickelback package. That's gonna give us the access to a couple of additional adjustments we could do. That's gonna help kind of protect some of the bombs uh, out of bunch tight end, and then we're just gonna come out. And really the key to this is, and I'll show you, we can do this out of almost anything. But I'm going to show it first out of Mike Blitz 3 because I think it's the easiest to set up. So you're going to go down to Mike Blitz 3. And what you'll notice is if I try to double team, I can double team this guy right here on the right. And this is kind of the problem, right? They'll slide, uh, they'll, they'll slide to the right, they'll double team, and then you can't contain them, and they get out of the pocket, and it's insane, right? Well, <coughs> within 3 through 5 wide, there's a little trick. And that is that we can spread our linebackers and then we can QB contain. And what you're going to notice here is that same situation. Now I can't, you probably hear my, my controller going, I can't get over there, right? I can't double team it. So now he's going to keep his contain. I'm going to run into him. Lamar is just that good. And he's going to break a tackle and get five yards anyway. Okay. So that's kind of the dilemma, and that's how a little bit of a fix to it. Now, notice something else that I think is really important to talk about. We don't have to, we don't have to blitz these three people. So we can actually drop these guys in zones, and I'll show just that right there. So you see here, we kind of dropped them into vert hooks, which is one of the best zones in the game. We got a three wreck because we know a three wreck will kind of read like it's a blitz. And now what you're going to notice is I get the same exact thing. And now I got additional players in coverage. So this is a way that you could kind of build off of this. And you can contain and get decent pressure only sending two people. You're going to blitz your user, of course. And then from there, we can really adjust our coverage however we see fit. For example, I love to uh, have a quarterback spy. I think that's one of the most important pieces. So we're going to have a quarterback spy. We're going to have a three wreck that can handle the running back. And then we're going to have a vert hook to the to that back side right there. And then we're going to be able to use her, you know, kind of whatever we want to have to use her uh, right here. And then I love the cover three cloud out of this. So you see it looks kind of like this. This is this is my play right here. And you don't have to spread your line. You can pinch them. You, you just need to spread your linebackers. That's the key to the defense. Okay. So now what you're going to see is they try to roll out we have contain we have a spy in case they try to run up the middle and then our user should be back in here on the crosser as you can see right there okay so that's a little bit of how you could kind of build around this now if you wanted to do this from man you could certainly do it from man uh, we're gonna go you know same thing vert hook boom 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 just like this have a have a bluff blitz assignment you know maybe have a spy something like this right here and you know now let's say they run a five out concept well you've got man coverage across the board with great underneath middle coverages they're passing off and then you're just taking whichever crosser gets open so that's another way that you can kind of contain the point is this if you want to contain in madden 22 it's hard and at the same time not hard you need contains you need a spy 
and then you really need a, um, in my personal opinion, you need to have a fast defensive tackle or whoever your spy is needs to be pretty fast. So I recommend Randy Gregory, uh, Dwight Freeney. Um, there's some other good ones as well. So, you know, you just grab a, a fast spy and you could kind of contain. Now I want to show you something else within this that is really popular, uh, at least at this point. This is something that was from last year. So they would contain, and then they would actually bring this guy out. So he's on a blitz. And let me show you how that works this year. I don't think it works as good. And what you'll see here is like he still kind of contains, but now I can easily roll around him, and I can throw, I can make my throw. But another thing that is gaining steam in Madden uh, from a contain or glitching contains perspective would be to essentially run to the right and then run back to the left just like that and you can kind of dumb out the contains and i'll show that one more time again this is primarily saying they're just blitzing those five so let me kind of set this up here but now you'll see you get this animation and you see how escape artists can just outrun them for you know 10 to 15 yards you guys have all probably experienced that well whenever you go to this defense that i just showed you where we spread and then contain and then we have a spy and a three wreck and and we have um, our user blitzed what you're going to notice now is if i try to do that um, you can just send that spy and you know in this situation he's a little obviously lamar is a little faster but you can send that spy and uh, and be in a little bit better shape another thing that you can do with this and and that's specifically if you do if you want to have this guy in the zone is you could do this where you pull this guy out on that contain kind of get yourself a little bit of space and now you're in a situation where see how he gets that one-on-one -on -one, and now we got him kind of kind of in trouble okay so containing the quarterback's not easy by any means i'm not saying that it is i'm just saying this defense can help you uh contain the quarterback a little bit better so if you're struggling to contain i would go to something like this and then what I would do is don't be afraid to, you know, widen these. You can widen these guys just a little bit and then make sure you're putting these guys on zones. I think you get significantly better uh, containing logic when the middle guys are on zones because they're the only players. They're the only players that the uh, they have, you know, so you've got contains and then my play arts glitch. But what you'll see here is now you get these wide angles, try to roll out and we can't do it. Okay, so thanks for watching the video. This is just the tip of the iceberg on the 335 wide defense. If you want to learn more about it, join the Patreon. By joining the Patreon, you're going to get access to all of my Madden 22 uh, offensive and defensive guides. If you're still watching and you want to check it out, head on down to the description. I put a link down there that you can check out. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.